Honestly, there is no such thing as the best shoes for skateboarding, it all depends on personal preference. Sure, there are shoes that last longer than others. Many products are available from skate shoes, each with several characteristics, benefits, and prices to help you make a knowledgeable decision. I researched comprehensively, read many reviews, and compiled a list of the best skate shoes from reputable brands. After much research, I found these products beneficial for people like you. Check my description if you want to know about the price and other information. So without any further delay let's jump into the video to watch the best skate shoes. Number 1. DC Men's Lynx Zero Casual Skate Shoe Vice host Taji Amin doesn't just torment himself for our entertainment on one-star reviews, he also has a big-time skater past, and his favorite shoe of all time is the MC Rap from Etnies, which reminds him of old-school shoes from the hip-hop-slash-skateboard world. The only bummer? They can be tough to track down. We could only find one signed pair on eBay, so set a watch alert for those, and in the meantime, opt for Amin's current favorite, the incredibly comfortable DC Lynx. The Lynx is also skater Tommy Wisdom's Goldilocks of shoes that he considers among the best skate shoes of all time, slightly tapered front for flip tricks, a padded upper for heel flip tricks, and the perfect amount of board feel. Number 2. Etnies Marana Skate Shoe Etnies was founded in 1986 with the goal of producing the most efficient, high-performing skate shoes. And it did so with the Marana, a sneaker that features Pro Foam 1 for impact absorption and STI Evolution Foam for durability. But the piece de resistance in the Michelin rubber outsole, yeah, like the rubber found on the wheels of most cars, so you know that it's going to be tough. Not to be outdone is the material of the upper, a technical fiber that is known to last the long haul. Etni stays true to its roots by sponsoring a world-class team of skateboarding, surfing, snowboarding, Moto X, and BMX athletes and continues its dedication by giving back to each of these communities. Number 3. DC Men's Callus Volk Low Top Casual Skate Shoe The DC Callus Volk is an all-around great skate shoe and another updated version of a classic. Josh Callis' first DC shoe was originally released in 1999 and shared the same side panel with the Callis Volk, but the similarities stopped there. Compared to the Callus OG, the Callus Volk is much thinner, slimmer, and weighs less atop a much simpler vulcanized sole. This shoe is very comfortable and requires virtually no time to break in, it's ready to hit the board straight out of the box. The suede toe is great for flip tricks and held up really well during testing, giving it points in durability. The vulcanized sole is very grippy, and the insoles are plush and soft, providing some impact protection and making this one of the most comfortable shoes in the bunch. Number 4. Adidas Originals Men's Sealy Sneaker The Adidas Sealy is a decent skate shoe with a very simple design that delivers an excellent board feel. This shoe has a narrow fit and is very thin, both in the sole and the materials throughout, which allows them to be ready to skate right away. The upper is made completely out of synthetic material which sits above a soft rubber vulcanized sole. The synthetic upper is fairly durable and holds up better than canvas, but won't last nearly as long as shoes made with real leather. The gum bottoms of the vulcanized sole deliver great traction and have a pivot point beneath the ball of the foot that is helpful for adjusting one's feet, and the rubber outsole grips the board well while doing tricks. Number 5. Edney's Men's Jocelyn 2 Low Top Skate Shoe Named after one of California's secret skateboarding weapons Chris Jocelyn, the Edney's Jocelyn 2 is a professional skate shoe that is based on the Edney's Marana, with the same Michelin outsole but more updated. It's an impressive shoe and may look bulky at first, but it's very flexible and lightweight. At first glance, the shoe looks bulky and wide. To be honest, at first, I had my doubts about the board feel. Compared to the former Jocelyn shoes it now has stitching in the toe area, lace protection, and velcro strips on top. The Etnies Jocelyn 2 isn't a very durable skate shoe. Compared to the Etnies Veers, they last about half of that, maybe even less. You can skate in them for 20 hours or more, and it will look as good as if you just got it straight out of the box, but around 50 hours they were fast. 
That's all for my end. I make helpful videos daily, so do subscribe to my channel and hit the bell notification. If you need any more valuable information or if you want to know product's original price, do check out my description. For any kind of problems, please write a comment below. I can help you anytime further. Stay updated with our product as it will make your file much easier. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.